Hello children welcome to your class today we shall go through lesson 4 civil defense it is a very interesting topic civil defense means ek aam aadmi ko suraksha vyavastha sambhalne ki duty dena so civil defense or civil protection is an effort to protect the citizens from military attacks and natural disasters such as floods earthquakes epidemics and accidents like fire drowning etc in simple words we can say civil defense is basically the protection of the citizens by the citizens people can voluntarily become the members of this organization let's know something more about civil defense organization the civil defense organization was established in india in 1962 after the china war it is a voluntary citizens organization it provides all kinds of rescue operations and services for citizens safety as we have discussed that civil defense trains us to protect ourselves from the military attacks by the enemy countries among all the military attacks by the enemy countries air strike is the most dangerous because it destroys our property houses business and human beings Now the question arises how can we be aware of an air strike so for this children our armed forces use radar the word radar stands for radio detection and ranging let's know how a radar works a radar is a device or system which is used especially for detecting and locating objects such as aircrafts or surface features as of a planet after detecting the location of enemy's aircraft the local public is informed by the administrative officials through media or by using sound and light signals Let's know about a light signal that is called black out a black out is used to mislead the enemy at night during black out all lights in the populated areas are put off instead these lights are put on near seashores or river banks Dear children you must have witnessed some accidents in your mohalla or in your village and also you must have watched a military attack on television these accidents and attacks affect the human lives badly many people get injured so to protect their lives and cure them immediate assistance or treatment is given to the victims this immediate assistance or treatment to any injured person is called first aid for this citizens are trained to respond to emergency situations quickly among all the natural disasters and accidents fire is the most common sometimes our houses or other buildings catch fire due to our carelessness or due to natural reasons so children in this situation don't be panic for this you must have seen a fire extinguisher in your school let's see how it works
वन मोर थिंग चिल्ड्रेन लेट्स नो वॉट मेजर्स शुड वी टेक वेन डिफरेंट ऑब्जेक्ट कैच फायर फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ सॉलिड मेटेरियल्स लाइक वुड कोल एक्सेट्रा आर ऑन फायर पुट वॉटर डायरेक्टली ऑन दैम इफ गैस कैचेज फायर देन जूट सैक कैन बी यूज टू कवर इट to extinguish the fire but if liquid substances like petrol oil etc catch fire the air supply should be cut off and foam type fire extinguisher should be used sometimes there is fire due to electricity in this situation water should not be poured instead before extinguishing the fire power should be disconnected from the main switch that's all for today children goodbye